Pata India chapter discusses its activity plan for 2022. We have planned update and outlook meeting, which will be taking place uh, sometime during March, I believe. And uh, during this meeting, we'll be having this different ministries coming up to give a little update uh, about the situation and all. And uh, then we are also looking at uh, a part of signature event, which is part of Powerhouse. Uh, this will again be a webinar. It will be taking place sometime in the middle of 2022. Go to target new source markets. We are now focusing to a large extent on the Middle East uh, as well as West Europe. And uh, we also have developed a Luke East policy wherein uh, the first, uh, the we are trying to uh, promote Goa extensively in Southeast Asia as well as Oceania, Australia, New Zealand, those areas. But our primary focus is going to be uh, in strengthening the key markets like Russia, Kazakhstan, um, the Middle East, as well as uh, West Europe. star that is recognized by over 100 countries i think it was a great reassurance both for us about the protocols in place for covid about their safety and about knowing the hotel's commitment towards covid safety OTOAI president sees recovery by the middle of the year. The business did pick up, uh, but then again after the Omicron uh, these issues, the lot of cancellation had been done. Uh, but I'm still uh, hoping that you know things should settle down soon. Maybe after uh, less hope that 2022 bring cheers to all of us. 22 is going to be a recovery year according to me, and less uh, I'm uh, too positive about that. And I think by the second half of uh, 22, the business will come and 23, 24 would be the good year for tourism industry. Thailand scraps quarantine-free visa policy. Welcome Heritage launches Chitagar Resort and Spa in Jawai region of Rajasthan. The Suba Group introduces electric vehicle charging stations at all its hotels.